Hi, my name is Chris Scordall with Kaisercom, and we're back with another technology spotlight going over the different ways to retrieve voicemail uh, with Avaya IP Office and the Voicemail Pro system. And in this instance, we'll be showing unified messaging. In this clip, we'll show three different methods of retrieving voicemails via our Avaya IP desk phone, uh, Outlook on an individual's PC, whether in or outside of the office and also showing voicemail to email via a smartphone, in this case an iPhone. First we'll start, start with showing uh, message retrieval via visual voicemail on our Avaya desk phone. As you can see on our Avaya IP desk phone, in this case a 9630 desk phone, uh, we show that our message waiting indicator lights on, so you have the red light on the top corner. Also it's showing us to click this message button. This will take us into visual voicemail again visually representing our voicemails so again I go to listen to my voicemails 1 slash 2 slash 0 if I enter again I can see our 1 was 1 new message 2 old 0 saved if I open up the 1 new I can see the caller ID information so in this case 651895 number called me at 1040 today February 27th I can simply press play to listen to the message. Hi, this is Rob at XYZ Company. Um, I want you to send over the proposal. We're ready to pull the trigger. It has to be done today, so get back to me as soon as possible. Thank you. I can pause it. Right, I can good. play it again. I can back it up. Send over the proposal. We're ready to pull the trigger. Hi, this is Rob at... And again, to, to delete, I simply press the More button, go over to Delete, Simply press delete and the message is gone. Now since we're synced up, this also removed the message from my Outlook where my messages are pulling from my iPhone as well. So the message is gone in all instances. And now we'll switch over to checking your voicemail via email, whether inside or outside the office or anywhere you can get email. As you can see in Outlook, I have a new email from Voicemail Pro, which is our Avaya account. Simply opening that email, I see the caller ID information. It came from a Minnesota cell phone. The number listed to the right, and actually it's a play. I can play that message within the email itself. Hi, this is Rob at XYZ Company. Um, want you to send over the proposal. We're ready to pull the trigger. It has to be done today, so get back to me as soon as possible. Thanks a lot, Chris. If I were if I were outside of the office, tied up on another task, I could simply forward this to a colleague, to a group of colleagues, just like a standard email. And again, since we are synced up, as soon as I listen to this message or delete it, my message waiter, waiting indicator comes off the phone, deletes the message off of my Avaya phone as well. Now we'll show you how to check your voicemail via email. In this case, I'm checking my email via smartphone, my iPhone. Uh, as you can see, shows up as another new email from Voicemail Pro. Same thing we looked at in Outlook, in this case my iPhone. I can see the caller ID information. I can see the name of the caller, what time and date. To simply play the message, it's an embedded WAV file. I just simply click the message. Hi, this is Rob at XYZ Company. Um, want you to send over the proposal. We're ready to pull the trigger. It has to be done today. So get back to me as soon as possible. Thanks a lot, Chris. There we can listen to the message. We identify that it, this is a time-sensitive, important message. I can simply call the user back by looking at his caller ID information. I can forward it on to another user in my office. Uh, nonetheless, it saves dialing in from our voicemail system remotely every 30 minutes to see if you have a new message. We're looking at this real time, and again, since we're uni using unified messaging, as soon as I listen to this message or delete it, the same is true on my Avaya desk phone and, with, and inside of my Outlook email application. So today we showed you three different ways of checking voicemail, whether you're in the office, out of the office, but all in real time and all synced up together. Uh, keep in mind that we can still dial into the voicemail traditionally, put in our extension number and password and check our voicemail 
at any time, just the way you've always done. This way, we're looking at it real time again, and when I delete it, showing this live, I open the message. I can still play the message, it's, it's in all places, just showing that I looked at my message, it's read. As soon as I delete this message, whether it be from any device, as soon as my, ref my Outlook is refreshed, which refreshes my Avaya phone, it is gone. So as we just noticed here, if you can see on my Outlook, as soon as I deleted it from my iPhone, it's gone out of my Outlook. If I go into the phone itself, I no longer have a new message, and it's also removed from my old messages. Thanks again for joining us on another Technology Spotlight from Kaisercom. Happy calling.